Astrid, I admire your conviction and your confidence, but you are way, way out of your league. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Welcome back to Skyrim. This is Hill. And if you're listening to me, you know that something has gone wrong because I love role playing and playing as my characters and rarely ever come out of character. But in this case, <laughs> oh, I'm left with no choice. I tell you, Bethesda. Um, the Dark Brotherhood quest line seems to be completely and utterly broken. I'll just put it out like that. Um, I was able to get through the last mission, uh, breaching security by using console commands, and I'm going to try that one more time with the, the next mission here, the Cure for Madness. Uh, I'm going to try to finish the Dark Brotherhood questline the best I can, um, using the, the console commands to get through it, if possible. Uh, if not, I'll, I'll switch gears a little bit with the story. I don't know if the broken quests are only related to the Dark Brotherhood. I don't know if this is going to extend to other missions, but if it does seem like, um, you know, this mod list is completely broken and I can't proceed, I am going to have to end it, and I, I, gosh, do I regret having to do that because I had so many plans for this, and I just hope it doesn't come to that. But I just want you all to be prepared. If you know you you see a video coming up here soon, and and it says this is the last episode, but I've tried. I have tried all sorts of you know googling, you know, looking for answers to try to fix this. And the only thing that I've got right now is using the console commands to try to do the set stage to, to move the quest along artificially, manually, however you want to look at it. So we're going to try that with the Cure for Madness, see if we can't, you know, get further in, in this uh, Dark Brotherhood quest. If this starts to break down and fail, you know, I, I might try a different quest, but just be prepared that we may have to move on to something else, a different character and a different mod list. Okay, well that's all and just want to thank all of you though for, for watching, for the support, for the subscriptions, you know, keep, keep them coming, keep the likes coming, you know, I, I really appreciate it. I look forward to seeing your comments and replying to your comments, so just thank you and you know, Honestly, I mean, I, I don't even like to bring this up, but I'm getting close to 1,000 subscribers. Um, I really don't do this for the subscribers and money and all this kind of stuff. I do it because I enjoy playing video games, especially Skyrim. So this is just from the heart, me playing, but I appreciate, you know, any help along the way or, you know, the likes, subscriptions. I, I appreciate it all, but... You know, this is just my love of video games. And um, thank you for coming along on the ride. Astrid. Brother. <laughs> Damnable jester. You got nothing, huh? So I take it by the blood here on the ground that someone was attacked. It might have been you, Need Zara. something? Okay. Stay safe. But apparently we're not getting anywhere with the mission, so let's go ahead and have the master intervene. All right, the cure for madness. Already, there is no quest. And when I talk to you, need something? You have nothing to say. 
damnable jester. Whatever it is he did that we can't see. All right, I'm going to set the next stage. All right, I need to search Cicero's room. And now we have a quest marker. All right. That's a relief. I didn't want to have to say goodbye to all of you. All right, where is Cicero's room? What? Cicero, what are you doing here? You're supposed to have been gone. Oh, hello, hello! Hello. What can you tell me about yourself? Me? Oh, Cicero is just the keeper. I keep. I look after our matron, you see, the Night Mother. I keep her clean and protected and... happy? <gasps> But I'm not the listener. Oh, no. <laughs> you are the listener. You heard the words. And everything will soon be put right. <laughs> All right, so this isn't right, because you should be oh, yeah. gone. Unfinished business, you and I. Well, I'm going to search the room, even with you in it. And what is this saying? I have written the letters so polite, so official. To Astrid in Skyrim, her sanctuary still stands, still operates, but how? No listener means no black sacrament. No black sacrament means no contracts. Her family can abandon the old ways and still survive. Still kill, but is that? Family, still brotherhood. Or something else, something new, something different, something wrong, something wrong. Still, we must go. Tomorrow we set sail. All right, so this is just his journals. All right, I'll just read the last one here. Mother and keeper must go. I am not the listener and never will be, but I am the keeper. I must serve my mother's will above my own. I must find her listener. I must teach Astrid the error of her ways, the beauty and necessity of the old ways. I have sent the letter to Astrid. We leave soon, but Cicero will keep this sanctuary as his sanctuary, a place to rest and ply my trade for once more, take up the blade and send some lucky souls back to him when laughter strikes as fits my whim. Okay. I'll take the gold, too. All right, Cicero, I'll pretend that I didn't see you here. Sneak out when you can. I'll try to distract the others. Astrid. Have you found something? Yes, Cicero's journal. Good, good. Does it say where he may be headed? Yes, an abandoned sanctuary in Dawnstar. I have the passphrase. The Dawnstar Sanctuary? Whatever for. <laughs> Never mind, it doesn't matter. You need to leave. Now. Every moment counts. So I want you to take my horse. His name is Shadowmere. You'll find him outside by the pool. Let's just say he's... one of us. Find Arnbjorn. Make sure my husband's oh, all boy. right. Arnbjorn is right send behind that you. Jester's twisted little soul to the void. In as many pieces as possible. Hmm. Oh, wait. Arnbjorn is gone. There might be hope yet. So, did something set Cicero off? No, nothing. At least, nothing I'm aware of. 
Well, if I'm being honest, I haven't exactly been discreet lately in expressing my frustration with this whole situation. No, you haven't been discreet. Obeying the Night Mother. You being the listener. It's ridiculous. Is it? No offense. Oh, I'm offended. Cicero may have overheard me talking to one of the others about the Night Mother. He probably it's did. It's possible I was not entirely respectful. But not to surprising go far, for you. To attempt to murder the leader of a sanctuary. Cicero must pay with his life. <laughs> there is no other option. Well, I know that someone must pay with their life. I'm not so sure that it's Cicero. So, on to more pleasant things, Astrid. What do you know, what do we know about the Dawnstar Sanctuary? Oh, it's ancient. Apparently one of the first sanctuaries in Skyrim. It hasn't been used by the Brotherhood in close to a hundred years. If you say Cicero has gone there, it stands to reason that he's familiar with the place. That means you'll be fighting him on his own ground. Tread carefully. All right. And isn't there any way to work this out? Look, the Dark Brotherhood is a family. This sanctuary is a family. And we've always welcomed those shunned by society. Werewolves, wizards, eternal ten-year-old vampires. What does it matter? In truth, I've rarely met a lunatic I haven't liked. Hmm. Cicero's problem isn't his madness. It's an adherence to an ancient, outmoded way of life. The Night Mother's ways simply are not our ways. But they should he be your ways. He just couldn't accept that. Our ways. And now he'll have to pay the price. Is it truly Cicero that is going to have to pay the price, Astrid? Think about it. The old ways are the ways. So says Sithis. Damnable jester. All right then, people. It looks like Arnbjorn is gone, and I would wager that Cicero is no longer, well, he probably snuck out while we were talking. Anyway, let me go and see if I can't find where he is. And see what's happened with Arnbjorn. So, Shadow Mare. <laughs> by Sithis, by the one. <laughs> well, if you aren't evil incarnate. There we are. You know I'm going to miss my conjured horse, though. Hopefully, you won't, uh, I have no idea if you're invulnerable. None of the other horses have been, so I have no reason to suspect that you are. But we'll see. All right, then. It's time for us to go to Dawnstar. All right, here we are. I think I... Yes, I actually passed the sanctuary the other day. Your ancestors wouldn't want this, Silas. Why should I hide from it? This is my family's legacy. It's the past. Dead oaths on dead lips. Let it stay there. The museum is opening, Medina. <laughs> Yes, Master, the one, yes. I can see that I have business with that museum proprietor. Ah. Well. The quest seems to be continuing apace. On beyond. Should have figured Astrid would send you. 
<laughs> well, don't seem so happy to see me. <laughs> and you're hurt. <laughs> oh, what gave it away? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, gotta admit that little Chester's good with that butter knife. But don't A worry, butter knife indeed. I gave as good as I got. Well, where is Cicero now? In there, through the door. Some old sanctuary by the looks of it. I would have followed him, but I don't know the phrase. I know the phrase. I'll get Cicero. You go home. All right. You convinced me. Doubt I'd be much good to you anyway. You wouldn't be. A little be. fop cut me pretty deep. Mm -hmm. But I slashed him good. Pretty sure I severed an artery. Well... Don't know what you're gonna find in there. But you could probably just follow the blood. Well, that's good to know. And... You might want to send someone back to clean up the blood here. <laughs> All right. a lucky guess. I actually had no idea what the passphrase was. Listen! Oh, what? Is that you? Oh, I knew you'd come! Send the best to defeat the best. Astrid knew her stupid wolf couldn't slay. Slay Cicero. Cicero, I'm not here to kill you. You know we're on the same side. Astrid must be stopped. Oh, look. A set of jester clothes. <laughs> huh. Can't think of anybody that I know that would uh, look good in those. I'll just leave it here for now. Oh. Oh. Hold on here. Where are my weapons? striking me. As you can see, the Master's enchantments are already undoing me. <laughs> it was good of him to enchant my weapons. Cicero, you need to calm down. Well, I was able to bolster some of my skills by fighting that guardian. Must be this way. Follow the blood. Oh! Oh, the 
astronaut didn't get it. Are they dead yet? see how sneaky I actually am. No, they can't detect me. Thanks to the protection of the one. Nothing you can do to stop me. You can kill what's already dead. Oh, you'd be surprised what I can do. That's it. But it was worth it to get my skills to increase. <laughs> okay. down here where there's a bit more room. Oh. Mm, two against one. I'm gonna have to take you out then. Now, one on one. Frustrated. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, boy, am I taking a beating. Are there any more ghosts? Is this the way I'm going? What else? What's down here? Ah, uh, the one. <laughs> it's interesting that he's gone by so many names. It gets to be difficult which one to choose. Then it looks like the path leads through this broken stained glass. Chili. Mm. <laughs> You'll enjoy this. Not an original part of the sanctuary per se. Let's call it a forced addition. Enforced by what? Oh, come and see! Is that a troll? All right! So Cicero attacked that harlot Astrid! But what's a fool to do when his mother is slapped and is mocked? Surely the listener understands! There we are. No more ghosts. Disappointing. Wait, there might be someone down there. I see something glowing. Oh, yes. Cicero. What do you say? Another ghost. You know what? Let me try something here. There we are. <laughs> the one wanted me to be able to master magic, and I think I've done a good job. This is a, a giant chest. Well, 
hell if I could barely pick a novice lock. Not gonna have much chance with this one. All right, whatever. I'm not even trying. It's a waste of lock picks. <laughs> if it's any comfort, I do feel slightly bad about these are stupid as I got in my way. <laughs> but please, tell me that hulking sheepdog is bled to death. No. Oh. Unfortunately, on Bjorn is still alive. the way out and this is the way to Cicero hello Cicero I'm glad you were able to get out of the uh, sanctuary without being discovered I almost gave you away <laughs> you caught me I surrender There's only one cure for your madness, Cicero. <laughs> I want to say me, but it's the master. Oh, <laughs> I like that. Very good, very good. <laughs> Creative. <laughs> but killing me would be a mistake. Oh, yes. You would displease our mother. <laughs> For she's your mother, too, isn't she? Listener. Walk away! Let poor Cicero live! Tell the pretender Astrid that you did the job. Stabbed, strangled, drowned poor Cicero. One little itty bitty lie. <laughs> Cicero. You have nothing to fear from Do me. What you will. Cicero has no fight left. In the end, Sithis will judge us both. Yes, Sithis will. You're free to go. I'll leave some healing potions on the way out. We are going to take over the Dark Brotherhood and destroy it from the inside. Shadowmere. Let's get back to the other Brotherhood Sanctuary. Ah, On Bjorn Astrid. Safe, and for that you have my thanks. Oh, you're welcome. But what of the fool? Is Cicero dead? Ah, oh, let me sit down and take a load off. Arnbjorn is safe, and for that you have my thanks. You're welcome. But what of the fool? Is Cicero dead? 
Are you talking about yourself when you use the word fool? <laughs> Astrid, I admire your conviction and your confidence, but you are way, way out of your league. So yes, Cicero is dead. Excellent. Once again, you've proven yourself a born assassin. Tell you what, why don't you hold on to Shadowmere a while longer? He's a fine steed, and hasn't been ridden nearly as much as he should lately. And now that this Cicero mess has been mopped up, we can get back to the matter at hand, hmm? Hmm. Yeah, so, then what's the next task? There's just one more target before we strike out at the Emperor. Have you by chance heard of the Gourmet? Read his cookbook? I've it's seen become the quite a phenomenon. The Gourmet is scheduled to cook for the Emperor at a special dinner. You'll kill him, steal his writ of passage, and assume the role of Master Chef. Festus has been spearheading this part of the assassination plan. He's close to uncovering the identity of the Gourmet. You should report to him. Excellent. Stay safe. Well, it looks like the Dark Brotherhood quests will continue. <laughs>